Hi guys. Okay, independent sitting. Independent sitting, again, this is why you need to know all your milestones. Independent sitting happens about five and a half months, right? At four months of age, I know we want to progress those things, but if your child, when you put your child in sitting, they just sit. I don't know how else to pay say they just sit and that happens at about five and a half months at five and a half months too they're also bouncing in your lap and this is what articulates the thumb up from from coming up so you see you should see a child doing this and their thumbs articulate these are all your self-help skills right they feed and all that at four months of age you're going into still an advanced tummy time of airplane your child should be rolling over just fine they should be grabbing their feet around four and a half months this is really important for that pelvis because it, what it's grabbing the feet is you're pumping, right? And they're learning how to pump. It's not a grabbing the foot. It's a grabbing the feet and they're pumping, right? And so that's what's happening now at four and a half, four and a half months. And then they get a pubic bone strike. They're on their tummies and they go down and they strike that pubic bone strike. And this is where you get independent eating. The tongue now can come past the mouth and you can start working on your rice cereals, again, depending on your child's development. When you push a milestone, right, that pelvis still hasn't got set up. And so please don't use the Bumby because again, I don't want a scoliosis. I don't want hip issues. That's all soft tissue, guys. And you don't want to stretch it out and so forth. So if your child can't sit in independent sitting, you don't put them in independent sitting. And so at four months, it's just too early. You're doing great. I would love to see a video of her playing around on the floor to make sure those other foundational milestones are there going on and help you out there. Thanks so much. Good morning, Christina. Or I should say, I guess that's this afternoon.